Well, Mike Slifer is on assignment this afternoon. And well, on our first alert headlines, we are tracking some very mild temperatures. Today is the last day of the unseasonable warmth. We are in the low to even middle 60s at this hour. So get outside and enjoy it because we have a cold front on the way. That's going to bring our temperatures down for the weekend as we do trend cooler. And we are watching out for perhaps an overnight shower or early morning shower before we do clear things out. And then we have some precipitation on the busy travel days late Tuesday into Wednesday. So we've issued a first alert for that. Uh, mostly rain, but there's some indications that it may start out as a little wintry weather. So we'll talk more about that coming up. Let's take a look at first alert temperatures. And we've got some strong southerly winds pumping up some of this milder air. So 63 in Norwich and Chester and New Haven. Same thing with Windsor Locks. 62 in Hartford and 60 in Meriden. Of course, this is below, I mean above average, I should say, for this time of the year. All right, now we're talking about temperatures dropping, though. So this is tomorrow morning when you wake up on our first alert futurecast temperatures will be on the milder side to start out the day. Temperatures generally hold steady or start to fall during the late afternoon. And then as we head towards Sunday morning, we'll be in the 30s to start things out. And then Sunday afternoon, only topping out in the upper 40s and lower 50s. So much cooler than what we're seeing out there today. If you do have plans to head to the Yukon football game tomorrow, noontime kickoff, some clouds, maybe a brief passing shower at 8 a.m. if you're going to be out there early tailgating. Otherwise, we'll see a general clearing sky and temperatures holding around 50 and then dropping into the upper 40s during the afternoon. Here's our satellite and radar picture over the past few hours. You can see that we've had some scattered clouds moving on through and clouds will generally thicken as we go through the rest of today. Now here's that frontal boundary I was talking about. That's the one that's going to bring the cooler temperatures. It does have quite a bit of rain associated with it right now, but this is tending to weaken as it heads in our general direction and you'll see that here on first alert future cast as I put this into motion overnight into early tomorrow morning again a couple of scattered showers maybe another one around eight nine o'clock but by 11 and noon we start to dry things out bring back some sunshine notice the winds shift to a more northwesterly direction and that's going to bring down some of that cooler air a live look in New London though fantastic 62 degrees a mild breeze looking lovely there on the water and we've got the Christmas tree going up in New Haven on the green with 63 degrees and we'll check out downtown Hartford 62 degrees with a partly cloudy sky and again 60s for the next few hours then we drop down into the upper 50s as we head towards uh, later on tonight. So here's your first alert seven day forecast. Again, we are talking about the chance of a shower early Saturday morning, otherwise dropping temperatures during the afternoon, breezy and cool on Sunday with a temperature of 49 degrees, 51 along the shoreline. As we head towards Monday, a cooler day, 40s for daytime highs, but plenty of sunshine. Then we're watching that storm system that we've issued the first alert. Again, we could be talking about perhaps starting out as a wintry mix or rain later Tuesday, lasting into Wednesday with mostly rain on Wednesday, 48 degrees, but Thanksgiving Day on Thursday is looking good with lots of sunshine and temperatures in the middle 40s.